No, yay, 49.34. Give me some chicken. 49.40. I had enough megalos to survive 19 minutes and 40 seconds after the end. Thanks for messing around and some more Vampire Survivors Beswick. Menya is heading over to Abyss Foscari because I want to see just how long I can get Megalo form to last. That requires a stage with an Arcana on the map. Grab early. And I should be doing this on inverse, but why? Da da da. No servant. Da, da, da. Dang it, there was my other weapon. Make it bigger. Uh oh. That's not good. Oh man, there's just so many. There we go. Oh hey, some light sources. And no chicken among them. Really not getting stuck on this. Instead of going straight for the Arcana. Get that Boogle Blusions going. Well, Song of Mana would have been good. But for what I am planning and what I am needing. Nope. Well. You are Boogaloo Illusion. Okay, chained it good. There we go, final weapon. Yeah, since it's Abyssal Scar, that means early evolutions. There we go with Empty Tome. Finally. Four seasons. Can Labrador maxed out, which means it can evolve instantly. Into good eye shuffle. I get three extremely strong map clearing weapons. That will only get bigger and better as I level up with the Blue Illusions. And Skullomaniac means that I get more XP. Oh, yeah, chicken. Why hasn't the chest dropped yet? Oh. I can just sit on you guys because I'm not going out of Megalo form for a while. Go die, shuffle. There we go. I don't need to move all that quickly right now. There's something on top of me. Don't look like it. Hmm. 20,000 at 4 minutes is not bad. Gotta hold out for a hero. Drop me a chest. Oh yeah. This is a pretty long Megalo. Pretty goody good drops. I don't know whether it stacks the duration or just refreshes it. Either way, I'm gonna see how long it can go. Obviously with a full setup it would be better, but hey, under these rules. Pretty, pretty dang good to go like five minutes or whatever. That's a whole sixth of the run time of the level. Yeah, without Wicked Season, just can't get the numbers in correctly to chain it longer for what it'll end up being. I think Dex managed to actually run at the whole level. 
but I'm under much more constringent constraints. Ooh, maybe. Chest. Yay, chest. Now I can get all my dang XP. What? Oh. I didn't have it maxed out. I thought I did. Oopsie poopsie. Three thousand before the ten minute mark is pretty dang good. Alrighty. Pretty good. What was that? Can't do back to back like that. That just wouldn't make sense. Oh, were there always like mini orbs shooting out from the side like that? Is that a consequence of Megal or Godai's shuffle? I mean, I could easily get another under from Cronus box and then Wicked Season. And just add more. Oh, there was more Megalo. I think. What, what is going on? Why is it double blasting like that? Okay. Here's my Photon Storm chest. Okay. And now I can just random always everything. Oh yeah, that was 30-ish level. That was like, what, 42 levels? Excellent. Screen clears are a good thing. And this isn't even the pinnacle of her power. Ooh, that was... Like 80 levels. Amazing. Now we get dangerous. Hope I can get dangerous. I have no idea where I am. Stay still. This is much riskier than just grabbing awake. Well, granted, I don't think I would have needed awake anyway. 100k at the 11 minute mark. Pretty dang good. Here they come. I haven't used my revive at least. Okay, good. The Affinians are large enough that they'll just get hit by the instant death place, too. Is there anything? Am I even picking up anything? I can't even tell between everything covering the screen so well. Yeah, nice. Right, here comes the danger. Will you stop me? Nope. Nothing. Alright, I still have to be careful of stalker and crap. Ugh. Let's probably turn that off. Oh, yay, another level up storm. Man, even the... I don't think I've dropped Megalo, have I? Well, I actually don't need to be careful of Stalker then if I haven't dropped Megalo. I'm invincible. Oh, I'm stuck in like a corner or something, are I? Wow, I didn't get a level. I must have missed the Red Gym entirely. There's another Megalo. 
Uh, almost like 15 straight minutes of being in it, huh? Uh oh. Minions hit this. Wait, did I drop off of it? No, it just procked again. Oh, I can't even tell if I'm in it now because it's just this. Nope, I'm still in Megalo form. It actually gives a cooldown, doesn't it? Yeah. Well, I guess I can't tell how long I've been in Megalo form because it'll eventually drop. Oh, what the heck? How did that happen? What the heck could have possibly gone on to me to drop something like that? Well, I took no damage, so I must still be in Megalo form. Yep, there we go. All I need to do is move a tiny bit. Alright, over 200k in, well, what's effectively 9 minutes. Heck, if this was normal mode, I might actually be breaking the million mark. But it's not. Well, not hurry mode, not normal mode. Does Hyper actually increase spawns? There's a candy box. Hey, vacuum. That'll fix this up the right and proper. Nice. World 2. I think I'm going to chain it for like the whole length at this rate. Whole screen is nothing but white hot pain. And they're barely showing up. Well, get enough invincibility going. Or got enough instant kill going. What can stop you? Oh, hey, another vacuum. Grab that right away. There's another Megalo chain. I don't think I've actually dropped it once since the start. That's nice. I'll actually keep it going. And to answer the question. We're on a 64 area. Pretty good. And vacuum. Ooh, that was a big one. That lasted through all the growth season. Nice. 555 area. Not gonna hit the cap, but still pretty good. Should be breaking the 300k mark. On a hurry, that's not as efficient as it could be. That's 100% cooldown. Yep, there are more Megalo. Another vacuum around here. At least it's easier to see things when it's all white out. Hey, Rosary. Five hundred nineteen. There's the 300k mark. Not that bad considering. I just sort of threw this together at the last minute like usual. Oh, and hey, the one away boche orbs are now large enough that they're actually going to be hitting things too, huh? Mm hmm. Yeah, five minutes to get like nine. Yeah. yeah, like five minutes to hit. No, actually, it might actually hit 400k. It means I'm, I ran this build in regular. Not in hurry, I might actually hit the one million kill mark, huh? Oh, something to consider for the future. What, what am I doing? That was the worst possible time to do that. Well, 
I mean, it wasn't, but still, it wasn't good. Why did I, I got so distracted by the kill numbers? Boy. Skolo time. And they are barely showing up on screen. That's impressive. And I'm invincible, so it's not like they can get me if they do get in. There's another... Ooh, very big one. Oh gosh, that was, on, that was like 80 levels. 662. Eh, 300k, or 400k might be out of bounds. But still, if I wasn't running this, this would easily be in the high 100k. Or, if I was running this off of hurry, this easily could have been close to the million mark. Another Mago. Basically ran it as long as they could, huh? Hey, there's a vacuum. Yeah, it was a look at it go. 230 for 40k. Seems unlikely, but hey. Because if I was on the wall non hurry then i'd be getting a lot more of the weaker mobs at the start in addition to having effectively double time so give it a better chance to ramp up and then when it gets to the bigger stuff at the end here i'd be more powerful not that it really matters when you have a finion 30k in a minute half not likely not likely oh i'm getting lag hey armor wow i really went this far huh well only one level there's gotta be a vacuum around here somewhere. Heck, I think I'm gonna run the entire... I'm in one giant megalo. That's good. Obviously not gonna be able to do it afterwards. But I'll run it out. Till it runs out. Here's death for you. What? Oh, right, the Aura Logan. Wow, that was an incredible amount of levels. Right. Yep, I definitely do be thinking I got multiple Megalos. Alright, let's see how long after death I can run it. Oh, another one. What's all this other stuff coming in? Sort of map enemy, obviously, but... From where and when? I mean, there's no way I can kill it. It's, like, functionally impossible at this high a level without the percentage damage dealing of Infinite Corridor and Crimson Shroud. Still, I want to see how long she can go. I think I just... Triggered again. Still in megalo form. Oh, and there's also a bunch of Aura Logians on the ground. That's helping. Granted, it doesn't really matter because as soon as I fail, I'll drop and I doubt I'm going to chain it together that well. Oops. I can kind of see the map sometimes. There's pickups to grab. There's... Oh, even the arrows for the chest are getting bleeded out. Still in Megalo. I'm three minutes past the end, and I'm still in Megalo form. That's how much I stacked it up. Da -da 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 -da. Oh, finally got my red gem. Boy, that was an enormous amount of levels I had stocked up. If only I'd gotten it earlier. Death would have had another couple million HP. There. 
Yet it still doesn't matter. Good grief, it's five minutes past. I should just quit out at this point. Oh, there's an tractor up here. Grabbed it. Okay, so that's the highest I'm gonna get. 916. On a hurry, Abyss Foscari. Oh, rosary time. Yeah, heck, I think Death's HP is actually somewhere in the billions. Because of all the curse, too. Still getting kills. Still, this is still spawning. Still in Megalo form. Ridiculous. Okay, that's gotta be the absolute last amount of XP I'm getting. No way it's getting worse than this. What is that? Is that... Oh, it must... Wait, do random events still spawn in after the end of the... After death... Or after Red Reaper spawns in? <sighs> yep, there they go. You could still get mob spawns and light sources spawns. I think I got that Candle Arbador. Uh, exploding Candle Arbador event, which is... Lost some of that Scorpion there. I don't even know what Scorpion there does. Still scorpion enemies. It's kind of undescriptive if it's something else. Unless it's some sort of in joke. Oh hey, an NFT. That'll clearly make the difference here. Oh wait, if I just kill them normally, I don't get the white hand event, so I don't even know if it would work. I'm still still in Megalo. Good grief. I just trigger it again. I just accidentally unlocked unlimited Megalo on regular menu. Oh, there's still some gems somewhere. Yep. Despite getting multiple vacuums, they clearly aren't sucking up every gem. It really matters at this point, but... A. Hey. Yeah, I just proc Megalo again. Weird. Well, really just want to continue, but this is... Well, it's three hours off of having to post it. That's not good. That's never good. I really need to just stay up instead of going back to sleep because I'm tired. Because if I'm tired the whole day, then I'll actually go to sleep at a reasonable hour. Boy, this is a long one. I just want to just grab the shortest bonus stages just so that this doesn't explode too much. I think you're going to have to double divide this, huh? Oops. Oh, there's a vacuum beneath me. I'm almost spawning in on the edges still. And dropping XP gems. Like not a whole heck of a lot, but still. Good gravy. This is kind of absurd. I mean, they could go on this long. Maybe like two minutes after the end. Not 12. There's another 13. Wait, is the Mego? Huh. Well, I'm going to get to 400k at this rate. It'll be very slow, but it seems to be happening. It's not remotely what one would consider a good intention. 985 area. I'm going to hit the area cap, too. That'll be fun. Area cap is 1,000. I think all four of them in that little block are 1,000, including might. You're not going to get might that high unless you're using specific characters. And the Divine Bloodline might doesn't count towards it, so. Not really that important. Whereas everyone can get everything else mighted up, or area or duration, or speed it up. 
Granted, speed's only really useful for like two weapons. And with enough area, even that doesn't matter. It's Room Tracer and Bible, really. Room Tracer does is duration, it's not bounce based like some of the other things. Oh, I guess Faragi too. Good grief. Still in Megalo. Yep, there's 400k. Maybe they're spawning through random events and stuff. And I'm still in Megalo. This is kind of ridiculous. Yeah, if it gets up to an hour, I'm actually going to have to quit out because I don't have that much time. If this was earlier, I would let it run till I die, but still. Yeah, if I had started this right when I woke up, I would run it till I actually fell. Oh, man. That would be so nifty, too. It just keeps triggering Megalo. I could totally be 100k this right. Look at it go. Look at it go. Or I have obviously be a hundred K. I could break a million at this rate if I was on normal. Oh, hey, something else is spawning in. Uh I'm 27. Oh wow. Wait. I'm no longer in Megalo form. I'm gonna die soon. Er, I sure hope I can die soon. Right? Right? You're moving. You're not frozen. Is it literally just so lag that you can't actually hit me anymore? No, yay, 4934. Give me some chicken. 4940. I had enough Megalos to survive 19 minutes and 40 seconds after the end. 2.4 trillion, 1.5 jillion, 1.5 jillion, or billion in correct terminology. Wow, I was doing more DPS than the other two were doing damage. That's how you know Minion is one of the most ridiculous weapons in the game. Phew. Okay, so that lasted much, much longer than I thought it would. So, obviously not. Time to go over to good old Bat Country. Da, 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 da. Bats, 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 bats. Why didn't you drop gems? What? Huh. Da, 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 da. These are not things I need right now. There we go, phaser. Oh, I'm gonna die. Bat country. That's not encouraging. There we go. In Obrador to deal with all this nonsense before it happens. Well, I guess I'm going to Armadillo for my empty tome. It's always funny watching DLC characters use weapons from outside their DLC. Is it funny to you too, viewer? Thanks for watching, one person who got this far. And a Labrador. Ah, no opinion. Or no Shadow Servant. 
Benin is the evolution. Blow it up. Ooh, chickeny. All right. Going up some gym. Or a bonus stage wall. They are just room tracers, aren't they? Just colored differently. Weird. Is that what the intent behind room tracer always was? Is to emulate the bonus stage wall? Oh, these are the questions we must ask ourselves and... Sure, it took forever for Shadow Servant. Oh, there we go. Now I don't need to whine about myself being dumb. Except the fact that I just used the word me-self. I'm gonna go ahead and my hang in shame. No, I did not do that intentionally. Entirely slip of the mind, baby. The, I may try to present myself as more erudite and articulate than the average person and get whippersnapper about grammar and the proper uses of he and I. But then I do things like add my hang and misspeak with erudite. I'm pretty sure I'm not pronouncing it correctly. Oh, nice chest. That didn't actually... Oh, no, it did evolve Godai Shuffle. Just kind of looks similar to Four Seasons. Oh, no, it really doesn't. Well, either way, I need to make sure I have the other two evolved before things get... Or leveled up before things get out of hand. Oh, ugh. I just used... Uh, like a troglodyte. Been trying to eliminate my use of filler, but still. That just results in big empty space instead. But you know what they say. Mmm, vacuum. Uh, chest? Oh, I got double chests, actually. I'm crewing right in front of me. You are not an evolution chest. Why are you not an evolution chest? For one weapon, I get it. For the other, that doesn't make any sense. Huh. Oh, great. At least this annihilates the bonuses to a ridiculous degree. I think I might actually get more luck here than elsewhere. It's annihilated all. Area, I guess. Doesn't really matter. It's just random always. It doesn't matter. I'm gonna win this by default. There are way too many power-ups on the map now. Let's try and look for them clovers, I guess. Or hope there's it's a lot of power-ups. If I didn't have that ridiculous me Megalo run, then this definitely would have been. Look at all them power-ups. Run. Oh, there you are. Double Clover, even. 161 luck. Ha. Huh. Oh, there's a chest. Give me my laser gun. 
Wow, that's so far away. What were you doing over here? Hey. Prophetic. Oh, not even that many bats are showing up anymore. They don't want to get lasered. Oh, this looks like an easy 100k on bat country. Do the bonuses count towards the kill? I mean, they take damage, but light sources take damage and they don't. These are more tagged as light source than anything else. Very weird light source. Oh, Arcana Chest is way over there. Now yeah, it's way over here. Now that's going to do much at the very end here, but might as well grab Wicked Season. We're Wicked. Oh, that means I can't actually move as much, huh? Lucky time, double my luck, make it 322. Or er, 3000 and er, 354. Oh, basic simple math, you are the only thing I understand in this world. Penitento. Level up. Level up quite a bit. It's a lot of vacuums to take. It's going to result in a lot of levels for the few minutes I have left. Oh, right. I don't even have a pinion yet. So I've got to change that. Next time growth season comes around. That's an evolution chest for sure. Oh wow, they're getting really quickly. Oh, I guess because opinion is not doing anything because it doesn't exist yet. There we go. You know, all of them can go for it. Uh, a sphere of invincibility caused by instant kill effect. Oh, wow. No, I actually find not that many. Huh. Well, not that they're going to get in through this and 211 walk. Not that it's a whole lot, but hey, it's enough to basically make it 100% at this point. Right? I, I don't know how the math works out on it. Yeah, I still haven't looked up what the damage numbers are. And they can't be right. Armor can't be working right. I'm taking too much damage when things hit me. Oh, I just completely missed that growth season, didn't I? Oh well, more gems for next time. Da 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 don't want to grab that rosary. Too dangerous. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Ooh, it's 200k in the cards. It looks like it is. If the screen cleared up enough for me to see it. That seems increasingly unlikely. There we go. Yep, 200k. Starburst, really. Wait, no, I'm invincible. That doesn't matter. Oh, wait, I'm skipping Megalomania because she's invincible. There's no reason to play her or ghost. Okay, so that's five more moon spell. Eight done. Boskari, so that's 13. 
and gets eight. Now, that's 21 from emergency meeting and then a couple from up top. About 30-ish, I think, maybe. About another month till the fourth wave and I really start making up the numbers. Ooh, what could it possibly be? Oh, hey, look. Oh, well, end of stage. Well, I don't want to sit here for forever, so enjoy that marvelous picture of pickups. Bye-bye. Yeah, the others didn't really get any time to shine. Oh, the boche counts as a weapon. I mean, it always did. It just counts for a megalo mania weapon. Or mania in megalo form. All right, and it's time to round out Menya's adventures over in Hectic Highway. Shouldn't be too much trouble, right? Right? Explode, please. There we go. Right away, evolution. Bad. Oh good, Shadow Servant. Please explode on the dang things. Oh, I need raw front power just to not die, so let's go with that for a bit. Okay, now that I am safe up front, let's focus on other things, like not dying. Oh, make a love for him. Now let's totally die. Oh, oh right, phaser is my other weapon. Hi, merchant. Oh, I want to kill all of you. Let none survive the wrath of Menya Moon spell in Mago form. But not Megalo Menya Moon spell. Completely different character. Oh, how dare anything survive? How dare they? There we go. Chain it together. Chain it together. I should go down a bit just to get more XP. All right, that's hitting the false screen. I'm gonna jam on the right stick. Do literally no benefit. Well, no, I still need to loop to get the chests. So, oh boy, am I not going to be seeing any of these. And to mash on the A button. Oh, did I loop already? Wow. Speed! Phaser, phaser. Huff, 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 phaser. Trademark of Star Trek. Yay, evolution. That figures. Uh, three minutes. It's four for the boss, right? Well, not that it really matters at this point, but still. Really? Go die. My god, five level ups. Like, I know the odds are not in my favor, but still, really, come on, son. Don't oh, get back here, chest. Dang it. At least I know where it is, so I can jam on the right. Jam on the right and keep going. Oh boy. Thank you for existing, D-pad. Thank you for existing. Going Megalo. Boy, that's a lot of levels. 
Not that I really need it since sort of clearing house as it is, but still, I prefer to be efficient. Just in case. Just in case. I'm more scared of here than backcountry. Da -da -da -da, da -da 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 -da. Megalo has leveled up quite a lot. No, that's just the chest I've already gotten. Here we go. Charge onto the wild, not blue yonder. Are you kidding me? It was that high up. Just random always at this point. Great. You know, and an arcana chest too. Really wish the arrows were it lined correctly with where it was from the start instead of just going up to the top like that. It's really annoying. In fact, why are they? I mean, it's obviously some sort of programming necessity with how this stage scrolls, but. Ow. Oh, getting close to the chest. Alright, all the way down at the bottom, as you'd figure. I guess maybe. Alright, charge! Oh, hey, we're all again. Charge! Open. Offenian. I were the snake. And another chest showed up. Yay. That don't really matter at this point, but still. And that boss barely lasts a second. I mean, it's still longer than a lot of the other bosses who I never even saw show up. Here we go. And no more chests are needed. And I'm invincible, and I don't think Stalker can spawn on Harlow Carter Hectic Highway. Well, from random event anyway. I should be safe to just take my hands off the controller. And rest. Stretchy, stretch, stretch your arms, get your arms and go. Oh, and please tell me if the audio for my voice is too awkward. I really set it up high because when it was coming out of my TV, when I was rewatching my videos as a test to see the audio, I really pumped it up because in my usual sound settings, I couldn't hear myself very well. well. It's pretty clear at my usual sound settings for a lot of other streamers or videos. I mean, it sounded perfectly fine when I was on doing it headphones, but... Well, I basically turned it down to the absolute lowest volume there, and it can, I can still hear things okay enough. Headphones are very loud, is what I'm saying. Oh, right, no, I should be near the, closer to the top so I can get the experience from that. Yep, just like I thought it would be. 100k on Hectic Highway, not bad. Still not going up all of that quickly. Oh, right. I guess I need to grab Wicked Season 2, huh? It popped. Not too bad I'm not going to be able to see it at all. The arrow isn't even showing up. Well, that's because I haven't looped it to the right yet. Huh. A merchant static. He doesn't loop. So it's everything else that loops.
Huh. That's odd. I break the looping somehow? Is it time based or something? I can kind of see the arrows. They might as well throw in Wicked Season even if it's not going to do anything this light and I can't really control anything here. Oh, I can barely see a thing. Oh, there we go. Just barely caught it. There we go. I'm at the top. Just a bit down so I can get the stuff up top and go. Like I said, it doesn't really matter at this point. But yeah, please let me know how my voice sounds. It's really hard for me to tell because different strokes have different folks and different folks have different strokes. Yeah, I totally intended that from the start and didn't just cover my own behind. Uh, it's nice to just be able to take my hands off the controller and, you know, not pay attention to the game I paid money for repeatedly. Something that Pirate Software Thor is talking about. Oh, you know, all the DLCs and stuff. It's like fine if you're starting from, well, the beginning. Two bucks here and there isn't going to be a big deal for you. But for anyone new, they're going to look at all the DLC and see like, oh, five for the base, then two, 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 and that adds up more in their mind. Play catch up with everyone else. But you know, fair point. Good point. That's why Blizzard doesn't make you pay for every bloody expansion pack to get up to play in to the latest one. Dang it, stupid shoulder. Uh, I have a position in such a way. If I just Change my position a bit. Causes issues, and I slam my shoulder into the mic. Yeah, I could put it further away, but I'm worried that if I do, it won't catch my terrible voice, or it starts catching other stuff. Should really test it, but well, I don't get to take days off. Someone loved to just screw me over. Wait, is it 25? No, no, it's 20. There's another victory. Yeah, opinion, just gonna get anything done. Good eye shuffle was trouncing it. Not enough stats. Yep, there's all three. Well, I can't check menus, but I can check McCoyonis. Oh, why can't I go over there? Oh, no, I can scroll it and yeah, there's everything done. Good amount of stages done for menu. And Menia has gone Megalo for a very long time, taking us up past the 400 mark. 401 on Abyss Los Kari, 402 on Bat Country, and 403 on the Hectic Highway. We're getting to the 400s now. It shouldn't be that long, only forever. Phew. Anyway, that's 1,529 more to go. 
sometime this century. Thank you for watching. I hope you had some fun. Thank you for anyone who has liked, disliked, commented, or subscribed. And if you haven't done so, please do so. Either way, I hope you have a good day and you keep messing around in the Vampire Survivor's Beswick.